Hello you guys, this is the Team XHD here, bringing you guys a commentary on a Gears of War 3 game that I played a little while back, but it was a fairly good one. I was playing along with my friend Django222 here, and we just decided to team deathmatch it up, so uh, I don't know if anybody else in the FOD side watches Gears of War, but if not, then this may be a good opportunity for you to see sort of what the game looks like as an Xbox exclusive and why I enjoy it so much because of all the fast-paced action and all the crazy ass shit you gotta do to win like it's a really team based game but the main reason I'm here guys is not to discuss Gears of War because I could go on for like five videos talking about why I love this game but uh my main reason here today is to post a commentary up and discuss a bit about FOD just talking a little bit about what's going on on FOD uh, YouTube channel my YouTube channel the uh, FOD on the Xbox side and a couple big events that happened recently that were very enjoyable to uh, take part in. But first let's go straight through to uh, what's going on and uh, one of the things that people have been asking me about is the FOD showdown and that is a big priority on my list right now and I know it may not seem that way because I haven't put anything uh, in relative to an announcement to you guys about it. But that was for one reason because I didn't have the YouTube updated password that I wanted to have. But uh, first of all, the FOD Showdown, episode number two, the first part, if you haven't seen it already, is up on my channel. The uh, second part will eventually be up. And by eventually, I mean probably this weekend, because this weekend I am free. Like, oh, look at that. You know, go to this one. Was, uh, I'm absolutely free, and I have nothing to do at all. So I will be trying to post that up. But the reason I have not posted it up is because of the fact that... Uh, <laughs> Man, like, I don't even know how to start with this. I want to make it short and sweet, because I don't want to make this whole thing about just me and my laptop. But my laptop, right after my physics exam on a couple Wednesdays ago, actually, it was, yeah, it was a lot of Wednesdays ago, about four Wednesdays ago. So about four weeks ago, it completely got shot, and I was hoping to salvage some of the original files of the showdown on my hard drive, and that ended up not happening. So I, try, I was sort of holding on to the hope that they that I would get the files back, and then I would upload a delayed version but unfortunately that is not going to happen so I have recorded the gameplay of the showdown and I'm going to do it in sort of a highlight reel style and I don't know if people will enjoy this more but I prefer doing it live just so I can hear the game chat and such but uh, the next showdown will not take place for quite a while yet but I will try and get the showdown up as fast as I can and post it in a highlight reel manner and then you guys will get some kind of foreclosure as to who won the showdown, but it should seem a little obvious from the first one, but uh, I'm going to keep trying to give you guys a little bit more content over the course of the summer. It should be really nice to get uh, up some more gameplay. I'm going to be getting up a clan war on the FOD channel as well. That's a big thing. I'm going to be bringing that to you guys soon enough. I've got a... It was really fun, actually. I'll, I'll, tell, I'll talk a bit about that right now. Uh, the clan war, there was a clan that challenged us over uh, YouTube. I had uploaded a video of the Green Battle Patch, and they sort of, they came over and they said, hey, do you want to do a nice little clan battle? And it wasn't cocky, sort of bitchy, whiny sort of thing, and they just said, okay, let's, let's go for it. And they decided to challenge us, and we went, okay, that's good. And you know what day it was on, guys? It was on the Wednesday, last Wednesday, i.e., the 18th, I believe, was that day. Yes, the 18th. And guess what came out that day? If you don't know and you play Modern Warfare 3, then you guys are the dumbest motherfuckers. I am just kidding. But what came out that day is Terminal. So what? guess what we did for first map? Domination on Terminal. And guess how much fun I had there? A shit ton, because that was one of the greatest. It was so fun to play that map. And what was really strange about the clan match, guys, was that it was no hold bar, so anything went, except for a couple things. We sort of agreed on some things that were not fair, and one of those things just so happened to be rocket launchers and a couple other things. But uh, there was rocket launchers, uh, motion sensors, and stuff like that, but it was really competitive, and I'm not going to spoil what happened. If, you, if you're on the Xbox side, you already know what happened because I posted a thread about it, but... Uh, I'll let you guys take a look at the video when it's uploaded. Uh, a bit of it's going to go to my channel. And it's going to be in a new format, actually. I've been trying out different formats for uploading videos. And one of those formats was split screen mode. And if you don't know what that is, is it is making two gameplays side by side with uh, showing different perspectives on each. And as an uh, example, on the video I have my perspective and I also have another person's perspective. 
right next to me so you can sort of see the different uh, ways that things, the different ways that we work together and communicate. But uh, that was one of the things that I really did uh, enjoy a lot. It was doing the split screen and it, it takes a while to render but that can be overlooked simply because of the fact that uh, it's really, uh, how do I say this? Because it's really enjoyable just to see the si the different sides of when we play the games and of course I you can hear the different chatting of each people and of each person rather so you can take a look oh fuck oh geez okay never mind that uh, is long shot I, I probably would talk about Gears for a long time if I had the choice but uh regardless the, the Xbox exclusives I'm going to uh, I was really happy about because I'm I actually had we might have a clan war in Gears of War 3 as well and that would be great because I really do wow how was that not a headshot okay whatever uh anyway if you haven't already noticed, I kind of get a bit sidetracked on the gameplay because I am generally not a happy gamer, and I'm not going to lie about that. Gaming is not a happy thing for me. It's It can be recreational, but it's not a happy thing. It's sort of get in there and win. I'm not really casual with it. And I, if you ever play with, like, I know a couple people know this, but I rage quite a bit when I play, and that it depends on the day if I... I'm really pissed off. Like with, I have, I play football, American football. So I uh, go to practice every morning, and I get my. Uh, I have to tackle, play. like not tackling, but like it's not even like I enjoy playing football. It's not something that I completely dislike doing, but uh, it's just it's hard to get up in the mornings and then get back and then be all cheery about it because you're tired. Is like you think that if you're tired that you wouldn't be happy about it, but it's just that I do get a little bit mad when I play, and it, it can be. To, to a really bad extent at times, but people who know that know that, and it, it's sometimes easier to cure it just by chillaxing a little bit. Playing a single player game is something sometimes I do, or play a more casual game. And like the therapy I use is sometimes Skate 2, I play that game, I really enjoy that game. But I also, if you have ever seen my Let's Play Skate 2 The Free Skate Challenges, I rage at that game as well. And that is, if you can take a look at that on my channel, Let's Play Skate 2 The Free Skate Challenges, if you're ever interested in seeing me rage at a skating game where there's no competition whatsoever but yeah so uh, FOD clan war talked about that talked a bit about uh, what's been going on and this guy's about to get body yep and talked a bit about how things are rolling oh chainsaws chainsaws I hate chainsaws so people do that they just walk up to you and they're like okay I'm just gonna hold the B button I'm gonna chainsaw you but yeah I thought I would talk a little bit about that so I did talk about the clan war I talked a bit about years of war and oh that guy just got his wig split, you know, but I talked a bit about uh, Gamer Rage, and I am going to talk a little bit about something else. There was one other thing I wanted to talk about, and I cannot remember it, and I apologize, but uh, there's got to be something here. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying to think about it, what it was on the fly. It was somewhat important, but I'll think of it as we go. So I'll talk a bit about... Uh, years of war here and also I actually this is this more so goes out to uh, a lot of the FOD directors who that I got funny. a lot of the FOD directors uh I am really looking forward to capturing and record like capturing slash recording because it's the same damn thing <laughs> recording ca counter strike gameplay on the PC and I now re I just recently re-downloaded Counter Strike after losing it on my uh, old laptop, and I re-downloaded it on my larger computer, so on the big desktop computer that is in a different room, and now I can actually play it without getting really pissed off because I don't jump all over the place. Because if you know, holding holding Counter Strike to all of its greatness, it really does. It's hard to play when you have a laptop, and so when you got the desktop, then it's a lot easier. But uh. I have that now, and if anybody is looking to add the Team Max HD on Steam and is looking to play a bit of Counter Strike or maybe some Team Fortress 2, then go ahead and pop me an invite because I am willing to get a lot better. I mean, I played I played Counter Strike a lot, like a fair bit, so I do I am fairly good at it. But what I am not fairly good at is playing with friends on that at the point. I've only played by myself in gun game modes and stuff. And Gilly, I, I really admired Gilly for uploading Counter-Strike because that is one of the greatest games of our time. And it's, it's getting re remade, if you, if you didn't know. It's Counter-Strike GO or Counter-Strike Global Offensive. And that's a big one. That's, it's going to be a big game that's going to be coming out. And that's one thing I'm looking forward to. And I'm definitely not going to get it on console because it's going to be shit on console. 
But on the PC, I think it's going to be fantastic. And just like Counter-Strike Source that I have right now, it's really good. And it's a really enjoyable game. So if you haven't already taken a thought about it, you have until July 23rd on Steam to take a look at it. It's uh, Right now, it's only $10 to download Counter-Strike Source, which is a very good deal because Steam has their summer sale going on. And it's a, a, an amazing deal to... Uh, I don't know why I was shooting him with a shotgun, but... Uh, it's very a very great deal, and then you get to play a, I mean, Counter Strike can be a really frustrating game, but it's also really fun once you get used to it. And that's one thing that I was uh, trying to play a bit, and I'll get domed. And so this this commentary is coming to an end, and let me just con uh, wrap things up a bit. FOD Clan Battle coming soon. A uh, Counter Strike. Uh, if anybody has that and has a Steam account and wants to add me or play Team Fortress 2, even just uh, add me on Steam. My gamer or my, not on my gamer tag. Bleh, Steam doesn't have that. My Steam username is the space T Max space HD. If you are interested in joining along and getting to know me a little bit better, because I definitely want to know a bit more about the PC side of gaming and also play a bit with Gilly and uh, all the FOD crew, because I love I love the time I see them playing the PC games on their on the YouTube channel on FODclan.com or on the uh, FOD Gaming Clan channel at it, so I can see a lot of what they, uh, how much fun they're having with Counter-Strike, and it'd be a great time to tag along and have a little bit of fun. So if that's another thing that if you're interested in, just message me up about that. And uh, yeah, so this commentary, again, I'll say, is coming to a close, and I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like and subscribe to both the Foundations of Destruction channel and to all of our director channels located in the sub box because they have their own content that, is, while separate from the original FOD channel, is a stunning channel on its own. So take a look at those guys and I will see you guys around for more commentaries and for some more gameplay. See you around guys.